Hey guys, welcome back. This is Relax with J and C. I'm Jordan. I'm Cassie. And today we are going to be watching Dead Man's Shoes. Uh, this was suggested to me by Ryan. Watch me movie with Ryan. Uh, <laughs> so uh, be sure to check him out. He's a good channel and uh, he, he recommended this movie to me. So Ryan, if you're watching, thank you. We're going to check it out now. Um, I know literally absolutely nothing about this movie at all tell me the name again <laughs> dead man's shoes dead man's shoes and it's a it's a british film yes that's all i know i don't know who directs it i don't know who stars in it um i don't know anything so i don't know if it's if it's like a horror if it's a funny movie if it's a comedy yeah if it's... i don't know i mean just based on the title i imagine they find a dead guy's shoes. I mean, because it, it could potentially be funny, because what was that funeral? Death at a funeral, that, yeah. I mean, you wouldn't know what that is. Yeah. And it just so happens to be like a dark humor comedy yeah. type movie. So. Well, we'll see. We're going to get into that now. So let's start it. All right. Rated NR. Violence. We'll see how much of this I can put on YouTube. Oh, right. Please tell me we'll the see. mouse is going to go away. Be held responsible. Oh. I, am I feel like British films always have like a field and people walking. Right. I don't know. I've, well, I mean, it's because we watch the detectorists, and that's what they do a lot. In oh, the... okay. But I don't know. I feel like I've seen this before, like something like this before in a British film. Oh, look at the cuties. Oh. <laughs> this must be them. Older. Yeah, that was my thought. I like the, like, chill, kind of, like, vibe. Yeah. I haven't really been paying attention to the names. Uh, I saw a few, but I didn't recognize any of them so far. Yeah, I probably... But I just, I love, like, old video type things like this, so I was, like, really <laughs> invested in it. <laughs> It's so cute. You don't see things like this a lot anymore, especially yeah. these days. Look at those pants. <laughs> like the button up ones. <laughs> those are. Oh, I did read that this came out in 2004. I was just going to ask the year because that's, yeah. that's, that's, a, that's a whole style right there. Yep. When I was. I rented it on Amazon. Oh, and that's okay. that's all I read was the published date. Oh, okay. Shane Meadows. I don't know who that is. Directed by Shane Meadows. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Wonder where they were going. Day one. God will oh. forgive them. <gasps> He'll forgive them and allow them into heaven. Oh. I can't live with that. Anthony, don't mess about with that fire, mate. Look at that castle up there. Yeah, I was just thinking, they, of course they show a castle, right? Yeah, that's cool. Okay. So, it seems like their parents died? Well, I was gonna say, they, they haven't them. showed any other people in present time, right? So... I was thinking, like, apocalyptic. Yeah. He's one, bro. Oh, Is that... 
From Stranger Things? No. No, he, no. Sorry, he's so much taller and, like, older, but he... This came out in 2004. I know! I... <laughs> well... Can't we, Matt? Sorry. The fuck are you looking at? It's a new cunt. Oh. Assuming that this is present time, so it's not an apocalypse movie now? I don't know. Was that, like, drugs? <laughs> I don't know. This is a very hard to read movie so far. I have no idea. Well, it doesn't help that we don't know anything about it. But... Yeah. Is that that's that the old guy? Oh, uh, was it? Yeah, I mean, it looks like him. No, maybe. I don't know. I don't think so, but... He kind of looks just like him. So it's drugs he's selling. Yeah, I mean, that was... It seems. Sorry about that up there, mate. I really just lost the head there. I don't know what happened to me there. I just don't know what came over me, eh? No, what's your name? No, it is. I'm called Urban I feel like I recognize that made me feel so uncomfortable the main guy for some I can't picture where I might know him from but him? yeah hmm. I don't know where I would even know him from but Janie and Rebecca loving getting each other off at the shower time that they really want you to join in well I would if I had a shower do you know what I mean oh jeez I love English <laughs> <laughs> you, guys, oh. you guys are really tasty spoon. <laughs> what? Okay. It's my kind of humor right there. Do me dearly, Mike. You know what I mean. I had a scout about and stuff, and as soon as I walked in, there was this fucking bloke having a, you know, having a bit of a butcher's at me. Listen, what the fucking hell are you looking at? Do you know what I mean? He goes, you, you cunt. Like, Get oh, out. You are. Seriously, man. Maybe he wants in on like the drug dealing. Something's gonna happen with that older guy. That I think is the same guy in the back in the um It was Anthony's brother, man. Anthony's brother. Who's Anthony? Seems like a great group of friends. Yeah. He definitely doesn't want to be there. No, he's super uncomfortable. Yeah. That was terrible. Mm. So are they saying that Tim? Oh no, that's him. That was him. He yeah. wasn't there. Yeah, yeah. That's his brother, though. I think so. I think. Those were the two little boys at the beginning. I'm gonna have to go back to town in a bit, mate, to sort some business out. I don't want to play with it. You don't have to. Seems like they're like hiding. Go on, then. Hold on, and you have been chosen as the lead astronaut. Fucking opinion as a connoisseur. This whole movie feels like a home video yeah the way they're filming it the dialogue doesn't really feel like Flowy. scripted either yeah it's, it's like it's just like seems just like natural they're just yeah. actually having it's like a bunch of friends hanging out yeah. yeah oh my god he's gonna be back again That's terrifying. Oh my god. <laughs> he said something.
something about from the fire? He said he said he looks like his eyes are on fire. Oh. That was just the drugs. Oh, okay. Yeah, I was gonna say, I think he probably got in the house. I don't know what that means, the writing. Yeah. It must be like a like a British something, right? I don't know. <laughs> Stoking? The first Stoking the fire? Oh, I feel so like out of water because I know yeah, I'm not used some to some of the terms. Yeah, oh, well, there he is. What the hell? Just casually walks in. I know. He probably figured they're gonna be passed out after seeing him. What is he holding? Yeah, a hammer. <gasps> Why does he have a hammer? It's for bashing skulls. Oh, don't say that out loud. Oh, God. <sighs> I was prepared. <laughs> yeah, so he didn't, I didn't show it. I assume he did it, though. No, I think that he had it just in case, oh. but I think he was spray painting something on their wall. You know, man, I was enjoying that. <laughs> it's an old beetle. Yeah. Look at that color. Just tell him Gear's gone, end of story, full stop, straight in with that. You don't think I've had it, innit? Gear. Gear. Is that all the drugs? drugs? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Kind of looks like Kilroy yeah. on his hood there. That old thing that uh, in World War Two they used to the... mark for yeah. I think it is, and they just like put eyes in it. Uh, maybe. Well, the Kilroy has eyes too. But... Oh. <laughs> I just remember just seeing like the line. Oh. <laughs> you all right, mate? <laughs> Why does he have the clown makeup on? Because of the guy that sat by him. Oh, he spray painted it on his face? Oh, I don't know. I don't think so. Yeah, why else would he have it? That would it would make sense that he did it to him, and he didn't realize it because he was asleep. So he must have been one of the guys that was asleep. I don't think he was. Okay. Uh maybe. Look at that, mate. Do you know that's acid. Ah, uh, what are you gonna do with it? I'm gonna give him a super duper fucking dose. I'm gonna send him to space, man. So mm. gone now, mate. Maybe he did do it to his face then. Because he definitely doesn't look like the guys. Yeah, so the two guys that were eating pizza, he doesn't look like one of them. That's not us. We ain't done that. Sorry, we came around me flat, man. We came around me flat and wrecked. That was him. It was so sudden. I know, it was actually. <laughs> Where is the elephant now? It, it, it's Antlis Bubba, isn't it? It's Antlis Bubba. He's like trying to get revenge for them, like, harming his little brother. Oh, I didn't realize. Making him do things. This guy. Yeah, it's the same guy right I there. I didn't realize that. I don't know why I'm having a hard time recognizing you. You really are, and I'm faces. falling along. <laughs> okay. This wow. is so hard to watch. Yeah. I thought they were abusing him. Yeah. No. Oh no. Let's not do that. Thank you. 
I was gonna say when I saw Anthony and his brother like in that building or whatever, I thought his Anthony was a little slow or something. But I didn't want to say anything. I wasn't sure, but now I think it's yeah. I think he's a little slow. Yeah, I also I feel like he was in a Black Mirror episode. Really? That one where you rewind it and it's in your eyes, the memories? Yeah. I think that's the boyfriend uh, of the blonde girl. <gasps> he might be. I, yeah. We'll have to look into that afterwards. I think it is. Yeah, so he's trying to get revenge right now. Uh, yeah. I would too. Fuck these guys. Oh, those were the guys with the pizzas. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So he did it to everybody. I guess so. Uh. I feel bad for that guy because he keeps getting beat up. <laughs> so they're clearly, they haven't showed all of his Was she acts. like his, the guy's girlfriend? The one that went into the uh, to military? I don't think so. Oh, is that Anthony's kid that he had with her on because he made her have sex with him? Maybe. These guys are fucked up, man. Yeah. They're all sitting in there like it's a freaking I know, right? a clown car. Seriously. Oh, he's wearing, and he's wearing clown makeup. That's funny. <laughs> I think you just put two and two together. Because they are a bunch of clowns, and they ran around in that yeah. clown car. That's oh, so funny. <laughs> you know, the lads had this ridiculous idea. That... Yeah, it was me. Oh, it was. Thought so. Uh-huh. Nice. Are you staying? Not since far. Come see me over here. Maybe I will. You're not afraid of me, are you? If I were you, I'd get in that fucking car and I'd get out of here, man. I like Richard. <sighs> He's in the intimidating. Of my yeah. I felt like I couldn't breathe through that part. Yeah. I was like. Well, he won that battle, so. I take a pop. No big deal. <laughs> Please come out, I'm gonna shoot. <laughs> He's still yeah. wearing the suit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking knobhead. Yeah, he's got these guys shook to their core, huh? I know, they're all like staying up and. Oh, fuck. <gasps> One down. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. That's brutal. What do you use the hammer? Yeah. Holy fuck. <sighs> they didn't even hear him. All of a sudden he went around the corner. Frickin' vigilante. 
Wait, they're going up to the farm? Yeah, that looks like it, right? I'd be staying far away. But then again, he's just going to come back and get you. Yeah, and this, they would kind of have an advantage in numbers here if they if all you, go together. If they went to the farm. Yeah. But I mean, with how meticulous he had been so far, I feel like it's not smart of them to just pull up. He probably has some sort of plan. Yeah, yeah, he's probably booby trapped or something. I don't know, something, <laughs> right? Well, because also he was in the military, so right. he, prob he probably has like some some plan at least. Oh, he's got. Oh, it looks like a rifle. I can't tell what. It looks like it's some kind of rifle with a scope on it, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I didn't see the the top coming up. Oh god, something's gonna happen. Look at the I don't know. I don't I'm scared. <laughs> he's not exactly hiding. No, he's just... they just they just pulled right up in the middle of the freaking day. <laughs> like... This is not I feel like he's not going to be in his house. Okay. <laughs> Just kidding. He's got an axe. I'm going to take your fat belly and I'm going to rub it in the fucking mud. You've got him. Oh, you missed. Look on his face. Look at him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> That's terrifying. Uh, the car oh. is definitely not a beetle, by the way. I take that back now. I didn't, yeah. I just went with it just because I don't, I didn't know the actual name of it. Quickly from the side, I kind of thought it looked like a Volkswagen beetle, but yeah, it's not. <laughs> no. That's okay. I know, I just feel bad for this guy the whole time. They're like literally abusing him. That's so sad. Oh, he feels so guilty. Yeah, only because his... Well, because now everyone's uh, yeah. dying. Should have done something about it then, dude. The fucking gearbox has gone, man. We're fucked. It was an accident. You saw him, Herbie. Get a grip for real. You fucking die. Tough. Tough. That's his name, I think. I think his name is Tough. Oh, is it? Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, it oh, is. Okay, tough. They okay. said it to him like three times. I uh, wasn't paying attention. Tough, get a grip, man. See, that's something I would say, but I would mean like not T-U-F-F-T-O. Yeah. U-G-H. Tough. You, you did it right. T-O-U-G-H. But his name was Tough. T-U-F-F. Man, I love their scenery they have. It's beautiful. So pretty. Now we should check this place out. Make sure no one's in there. <laughs> yeah, he's got them spooked, huh? Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> I just love the conversation. I know, having. the way that they communicate. Oh, he's... He is there. 
<laughs> he probably is... brought the guy back. Al. Oh, Al, think so? Like laid him on a bed or something. They're about to get freaked out. I don't know. Oh, he's in the kitchen. Oh. He's going to drug their That's tea. That's right. They're going to go to Space Man. Yeah. Never coming back. <laughs> <laughs> the way that he's... Oh, God. Stop. That is so scary. Stop. Oh, I can't get over that. I know. <laughs> <clears throat> yep. Oh, I can't wait for this. I can't wait for this. I'm, like, getting anxiety. Oh. <laughs> They're cleaning everything. <laughs> oh, my God. I was just thinking about how dirty their house was, too. funny <laughs> with them cleaning yeah oh basically just giving them a taste of what they were doing to the brother only ten times worse. Yeah. It's, well, maybe not, but you know what I mean. What's he about to do? <sighs> Kill him. Don't. That's definitely not a way I'd want to go. Not even a little bit. Oh, shit. Is <sighs> stressing you out? Yeah. So out of it, he can't He's even do it. He's just like, a, yeah, I don't even know. What to oh do. god, that looks painful. He put him in the. No. Yeah. No. No. no <sighs> yeah. No. Yeah. Is that tough? Yeah, it wasn't Al. Yeah. <gasps> <laughs> do you want to give him a kiss? No. I don't think I do. I'm starting to think this is more than just what he was doing to his brother. To what they were doing to his brother. It's hard to know. I mean, with that, so far, they've but only to shown... to kill them? I mean, f fucking kill them? Like, okay, maybe, like, make their life maybe miserable somehow? Like, I, I don't know. To actually kill them? <laughs> well, he's letting this guy live for so far. He said he was a good man. Let 
had your legs, didn't you, Noel? I promised you. You did, didn't you? Yeah. I don't go back on my word, mate. Promise. Hmm. I believe him. He's being genuine with him. I don't know. I'm still... still feel like maybe he's playing him. You think so? I thought he was down at the club. When he met him outside the door. Oh, okay. <laughs> I had a feeling. Why? I had a feeling. <laughs> because it's part of his vengeance. They all have to go. I thought he was going to let him live. That was more brutal than I feel like the other deaths. Yeah. Not, it was just, well, not more brutal, but it was definitely more pain personal. For, oh, yeah, maybe. It's, but why? It's very impersonal to shoot somebody. It's just you're here, they're there, they're dead. If you... Why did he make that so personal, though? Stabbing somebody is, a, is very personal. But I mean, he had a whole ass conversation with him. <laughs> yeah, he knew he could get information out of him if he told him he was just going to let him live. He was going to let him live. But then he's probably like, how can I let him live? I just He knows I killed all these people. He, could he was tell. never going to let him live. Yeah, he was. that was never his intention. That's what I'm saying, yeah. So he, that's how I know. I guess he couldn't let him live. It's a real feel-good movie, though. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, for these two, it's a feel-good movie. But if you were on the other side... Yeah, I guess, <laughs> right. And then you have, like, all of this calm, nice music. Yeah. Beautiful scenes of the fields. <laughs> Little cottages yeah. in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> Beyblades? What? <laughs> I forgot about that game. You didn't have any? I did. Okay, who's this now? Oh, this is where the guy lives. Mm, I think so. Where have you been? Oh, I'm telling you, it's something more. It's more than well, just the brother. Well, I have to see. Right now, I'm thinking it's just that. that. No, no way. He's not going to go I'm after, like, that. families. I feel like he's going to kill this family now. So it was a warning. Maybe just to get him out of the house. Or so he can get in, I guess. The wife and kids don't have anything to do with it, right? So let's hope they are... Uh... I know, I just couldn't. I couldn't. If he... <gasps> if he goes after the wife... I'm gonna die. He's gonna hold her hostage or something. Hi, can I help you? Hello, love is Marco, bro. No, he's just gone out with the lads, actually. Oh, that's a shame. Can I tell him who's calling? Yeah, my name's Richard. I'm an old friend of his from years ago. Was you in the park this morning? No, no. Did you meet my lads? I did. Yeah, because they came back with a mask and a knife. I was a bit upset, to be honest. It was blunt. I know, but it's a bit irresponsible, isn't it? I'm, I was really worried. But he did ask for you. He said um, he used to knock about with my brother years ago. Anthony. And Anthony used to hang about with us, like. We just had a laugh with him, you know, I had a laugh with him, but Sonny was just, just everything, everything. Why? Because he was just, didn't understand at all, he just, just, he didn't understand any of it. Is that the castle they showed in the beginning? Mm -hmm. It is. What are they doing? 
He's doing such a good job. I, f I feel so bad for him. can do something Was the last one I could have stayed, I could have stayed, I could have kept with him, but I didn't want to leave him. Don't tell me his brother was dead the whole time. He's going to take him to the castle. Why does that have to be so beautiful? <laughs> He's not even fighting him. No. Because he knows. Where he was murdered? See the 
pain and anger. And, oh my gosh, I know. <clears throat> you. You were supposed to be. I like that they're showing different camera angles of those deaths. It was yeah. like they had that the whole time. They're just showing it now. I've got kids. I've got children. I just want to lie with my brother. No, stop. He wants him to kill him? I think that's what he meant by that. He wants to lie with his brother. He's not going to be able to do it. <sighs> Why did they just show that? I didn't think he was going to be able to do it. I know. I just say that it's not based on a true story or something is it i was <laughs> i literally was like thinking that i uh um <laughs> i like need a minute because that was like Wow. That was an intense. It took me a minute to get used to the style. I and the yeah. and the accents and stuff. I know it's not even that extreme, but you know, being American, <laughs> it's, it's yeah. Just a it little. was just I'm not. I wasn't used to it necessarily, so it took me a second. But once I realized who the characters were and kind of the direction the movie was going in that um i i i i, I well i'm like speechless I, that actually really got me um that was a good movie it was i liked the way that it was like home movie like type directing so like I mean that whole movie like perspective like really gives it like a different feel than what I'm used to in a movie so that yeah. was kind of, but like I liked it it was cool oh, I, I really liked the movie I I had to get up and get some water because I just needed to take a break for a second um, but <laughs> I still can't even put my thoughts together really I, that whole movie was I thought the uh, Anthony, the brother, not Richard, who was killing everyone. I thought Anthony was alive. I it didn't. Same. And now I'm reading the title, and I'm like, I should have realized, I guess. But you don't really think about it necessarily until uh, it happens. But as soon, just before he was gonna pan, I was like, don't tell me he's been dead this whole time. So. Just 
just so you know, I did not catch that at all. Like, I was really caught off guard with that. I had no clue. I did not... I realized it just a millisecond before they revealed it, so it's not like I caught on to anything you didn't, but... I don't know. I just, I didn't, I really didn't think he was, I thought he was alive the whole entire time, and I yeah. thought that, um, I thought that's how Richard knew because, like, his brother was alive and, like, told him all the stuff that happened to him. Yeah, yeah. Right? And that's that's what I was thinking, yeah. And so I thought, like, when he, when Anthony was left at the castle with the rope around his neck, he just, like, somehow got out of it and, like, just found his and told, way. Yeah. So, <sighs> they didn't clarify and... I don't know if that's meant to be ambiguous or it's not, but Patty, the uh, the woman that had sex with him, she had a, a daughter. daughter. I assume that was her daughter. They didn't say whether that was Anthony's, Anthony's kid or not. I wonder if that's meant to be ambiguous. Um, I almost think maybe it was, but... Then again, the... I mean, she was dark haired, like, you know, just like him. And yeah. <laughs> but I don't, I mean, right, it could just be nothing. Yeah, because the last guy had kids, but they didn't show Patty's boyfriend or husband or anything. So I don't know. But I just, I just, I thought of that. But yeah. Man, I, I, in the beginning, this film was reminding me of. Oh, I'm going to have to look it up. Because I don't know the name of it. Hold on. Wow. This movie was, in the beginning, was kind of reminding me of Hardcore Henry. Um, not shot in first person or anything, but the way that the camera style was kind of filmed and it was like handheld and it was showing almost kind of like low, low budget, kind of like death scenes. Um, for whatever reason that I just got reminded of Hardcore Henry. I don't think you watched I've never it. seen Hardcore no, Henry. No, it's a but totally cheesy maybe some people will know what movie. You're Somebody about. might know what I'm talking about. I know that this film relates nothing to Hardcore Henry, but um, I was kind of the vibe I was getting at first. And then as the story progressed, I realized that obviously it's not anyway near the same. But um, yeah, that the twist ending almost like six cents where spoilers <laughs> bruce willis with a ghost the whole time yeah right so he he wasn't actually there with him his brother yeah. was like going crazy I, yeah i don't even know if he was just going he crazy like but a, he just well i mean he did go crazy he killed like did six he have people, like a but... mental illness or like he just went went crazy after his brother died and coming back pissed. from the military. Yeah, he just pissed and he's... I don't think it was meant to be like a mentally illness, like he's seeing his brother like a ghost or something. It was just so it was like like he was just coping and that's how yeah. he was coping was like talking to somebody. Man. But yeah. they didn't... Yeah, I mean, they didn't give any of it away... That if I rewatch it, there might be a sign that might show. Because I do remember when they first, when he first said, "I have to go back into town," and Anthony was like, "I don't want to go" or something like that. And he said, "You don't have to." Yeah, I don't remember what he said. That's what he said. Okay. He said, "You don't have to." Yeah. So that was, I guess, kind of a sign. But only, you would only catch that after if you've seen the movie. Yeah. You wouldn't know that he was dead. It would make sense because he, he doesn't have to. He's not right. alive. Right. Man. That I mean, was... I feel like a lot of times you're actually really good at, like, picking up stuff. And I felt like for once I was, like, picking things up this time. Yeah. Like, for once. Literally, this never happens, you guys. But I was actually, like... Uh, the old man, I pretty much called it. I was like, that guy, something with drugs, they, something with the brother, and that old guy in the window up there, and it's bad. And <laughs> yeah, I, for, I pretty much called all that. I don't know why. For some reason, in the beginning, I wasn't connecting the people in the past with the present time people. Yeah. I don't know why. I just, I don't, didn't recognize any of the actors, so I didn't. 
I'm just proud of myself. I you pretty I actually like predicted a lot of now that. I feel stupid saying that I thought maybe it was a post apocalyptic movie in the beginning. Oh I know. <laughs> <laughs> but they didn't show anybody else besides well, we Richard had and Anthony. No idea and he was in yeah. like an old rundown Right. <laughs> like and you, you know, house on a, like a farm in I'm the middle really of glad I never read the synopsis or anything yeah. like that they have because that might have given some of it away I wonder what it says actually yeah I mean you were you were literally like oh this new friend on YouTube yeah recommended this and we're just gonna watch it and I was like oh <laughs> okay dissatisfied soldier returns to his hometown to get what even, Even with the with thugs us. who brutalized his mentally challenged brother years ago. Right, so if we would have read that, <laughs> maybe things would have made a little bit more sense. Yeah, they didn't spoil anything with that, but... I think that if I had read this, things would have made more sense to me while watching it. I was just scared to read it, because sometimes... I'm glad I didn't. Yeah, sometimes they do spoil stuff, but... Emotional movie, very emotional movie. Extremely emotional. And I, was... I felt... So, so bad for Anthony. I felt so bad for him. I. Ugh. That was devastating. It was really hard to watch the way. Yeah. I mean, to imagine somebody doing that is just alone. Is. You have to be an evil, like sick yeah. individual. Sonny is a terrible, terrible person. Terrible person. Terrible person. Hate that guy. Hate that guy. He was awful. Like good for in the movie, <laughs> he was right, right. An awful person. He made, wow. You definitely, they definitely did a good job on making you hate them and Absolutely. like see them as terrible, awful human beings. I, I want to say that it's tough because like I want to say that I like feel kind of bad for the guy at the very end the guy who when he's yeah, like forced like, to kill yeah because uh, richard because seeing like the flashbacks obviously you could tell he was super uncomfortable and like he's just one guy like what the hell is he gonna do with this like mob of guys i still i was like say something i know and say I, something i think he's fucking awful and terrible for not saying and doing anything about it mm -hmm. but also you can clearly tell that he didn't want to be doing any of that he seemed uncomfortable yeah but i mean still at, the, at a certain point you gotta draw the line somewhere and you're tying a rope around I know. a mentally challenged guy's neck and yeah, telling him, don't yeah. fucking move or I'm going to kill you. Like, bro, you're, cl you're crossing a yeah. line, like, big time. Yeah. I mean, it's, I don't know how to explain it. It's not, it's not necessarily, like, I can't even think of the words. I, I mean, guess it's not, like, feeling bad for him, but it's, like, it's, it seemed like he kind of, like, got his life together and yeah, like had got a family and like all that stuff and was trying to move on from it. He definitely regretted his past mistakes. Right. For sure, Aside right? from but... his all his buddies who were thugs still and like selling drugs yeah. and like still terrible people. Yeah. It they seemed never like he changed. got away from that situation. He tried. At least. Well, right, because he said, "Oh, he's in the west." So he seemed like he drove like far out. You know what I mean? Mm. To get to him, so he was like. I don't know, so I guess that's what I'm trying to say is I don't know if I necessarily feel bad for him, but it seemed like he was trying to like make amends somehow. <laughs> I don't know. But yeah, that was insane. I was bawling my eyes out. I know. Ugh. Wow. Well, on that note, I think we're gonna wrap it up. But um, thank you, Ryan, for suggesting the movie. You guys it. check out watch me movie on youtube i'll put a link in my description here um but yeah he's got a great channel recommended me this movie and if he's got any more recommendations i'll take them that, yeah, that was a good one that was a fantastic movie phenomenal and, um, yeah yeah thank you see you later peace out